Good morning. Uh, this is Fred from Technical Support Team at DJRA. Today I'm going to explain to you how to replace the dental scanners, the power board, and the main board. As you know, uh, my colleague Mr. Yunjin he already took a video for how to how to disassemble and assemble about uh, inter chassis and exterior cover. So please follow his video. So first, uh, please prepare the 2.5 uh, driver. Uh, we call it box driver. And those things are just for the support. Okay. First, uh, first, you can see that there's like a four dry, uh, four dry, uh, four screws are in here. One, two, three, four. So please, uh, disassemble that. Okay. After that, uh, you can see there's like a two cables on here. The one thing is from the power switch, and one thing is from the stem motor. So yeah, please try to disassemble here. And then. Okay, you can see. Now it's just a simple. One more. Uh, lastly, you can see there's like a white label in here. This is uh, connecting from the power board to the main board. This is for protect the the eight pin cable from the RFID to the bottom board. So please, uh, this uh, test this one also. Okay. After that. You can see there is a really small like hole through here. You can see like a gray, uh, the gray the uh, plastics are connected with the main board and power board. So, yeah, please feel like that you can push it out. And please don't forget that there is like a power supply the connector is also like attached from the power board. So yeah, use it. I mean push it out. Okay. So this one is the power board. Uh, this version is a little bit like old version, like probably like a AH, but nowadays we are using the AJ version. So the power board is here, so you like write down like SDK. But nowadays the latest version is you can see this is SLA version. So when you try to do a firmware upgrade, so please try to follow the this power board version. After that, uh try to use this one also you can see there's like a four uh, four screws in here also try to disassemble here Okay, after that, you can see this the, uh, 60, 60 pin cable from front board to the main board is connected in here, so please take it out. See? Then finally, uh, you can see here the opposite side, the main board is connected with the PMT, so please disassemble the two cables. 
and I'm sorry, this is really lost. You can see the BLDC cable is connected with the main board. So nowadays we are not using that this is the longest cable, but I just want to uh, explain to you. Please just don't forget to remove these cables on here. I prefer this way. So just a little bit lean out. Not too much, just a little softly. And you can see there's a cables in here. Here, one, two, three. So please, yeah, disassemble here. Okay, so this is the main board, and you can see this like a SD memory card that's connected with through here. This is the how to the disassemble about the main board and the power board. Okay, so now uh, I'm gonna <coughs> replace the main board and the power board. Actually, this is the same one, but I just want to show you that like how to does it works. So just a report that what we did from the last video, but I will show it just once again. So please try to connect the those cables from here. Connect. Okay, connect. Yeah, please, uh, and then try to put, and then here, you know that this uh, 60 pin cable should be going front of the main board. And as you can see here that this is the hole, so make to fi fix it. When you replace the memory, please don't forget to uh, insert the same SD memory card. After that, of course, uh, try to connect uh, the 60 pin cable. As you can see, this is the hole has the balance. If you like uh, fix a little bit this way or this way, then the main board could not be work normally. So that's why I recommend you please like uh, insert it as a uh, balance. Please make it balance. Okay. Okay. So please <laughs> don't make mistake like me. So <clears throat> be aware of the this eight pin cable. After that, remember this uh, this driver to use the box driver with the screws and try to assemble one. And I just want to not at first push it uh, <coughs> inside perfectly because of the balance through the outer holes. So I'm gonna push it the opposite side from here. Probably the hole is not that be match. Okay, now it's fixed. Here also. After then, through here. And lastly, there's a screws in here. Okay, after that, 
remember that this is the power board so please try it we're gonna push it here you can see there's like a gray one the gray holes need to connect with the main board from here try to check that this one is correctly uh, this is correctly connect and also we have the power supply holes in here yeah so please check it everything after then okay push it Yeah, this is quite a little bit, uh, like a tough. Okay, so now it's connected through here, and I hope that you can see inside through here the main board and connect uh power board is connected for through the gray part. After then, connect the PMT through the main board. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't explain to you about this one. This one's the two holes in here. Uh, I mean, the two lines. Okay, look at the two lines in here. And this one's also the two holes. So please, the, I really want to recommend you, please don't make a mistake. Connect correctly. See? After that, Try to push the label to protect the 8 pin cable through the main board to the power board. Connect the power switch, power switch cable and stem motor cable. Finally, we're gonna fix it. also say I'm not gonna uh, assemble the first time at the perfectly cause for the balance this is just my way so I just want you just you you could refer my my way it's much easier to connect it Okay, so now we are done to replace the power board and the main board. Usually this one is uh, like a, uh, our the dental scanner is connect, uh, connect to it always. So please remember that. that when you need to replace the main board, then you need to, repl uh, you need to disassemble the power board first. Okay. Thank you so much. And if you have any like further technical issue, always welcome to contact us. Thanks a lot.